So while we go reporting on today, we have a construction update on Busch Gardens Williamsburg's 2020 coaster, Pantheon. <laughs> Hello there guys, my name is Coach Chad Onksterborn, Bob Bill for Theme Park News and welcome to a Theme Park News from Update from Busch Gardens Williamsburg. Now Busch Gardens Williamsburg is a big park to follow at the minute with both 2020 and 2021 developments, big developments coming in the next two years, uh, starting off next year with Pantheon. Now if you want a bit of a rundown on this project, basically this is going on a new expanded land uh, to the side of Festa Italia. Um, so it's going to go right near to Apollo's Chariot. Uh, you can you can literally see it from near Apollo's Chariot. Uh, we didn't know where it was going to be at first before we got the announcement. We got the teaser campaign for it, suggesting like a god themed ride, and we got the collection of gods instead. This is going to be uh, Pantheon, themed to a collection of mythical Roman gods, and of course the uh, parts of the layout actually represent different Roman gods as well. So basically, for those of you who don't know, this is an Intamin multi-launch with a vertical spike element as well as multiple inversions. So think more like Soaring with Dragon over in China. Think of that type of coaster, but instead of that non-inverting loop after the vertical spike, you're going to have this top part going through the rest of the layout. So, very bold decision to introduce this coaster. Of course, we know the stuff about Project 2021. Hashtag Giga on the way, in my opinion. BM Giga, Intamin Giga, you never know. Um, so we'll follow that in separate. Obviously you can go check the Busch Gardens and see World Parks playlist for more updates on both Pantheon and Project 2021. But we do have some construction images on Pantheon. Now big shout out to Falco, Falco Flair who wants us to do the update on Christmas Town. We got that. And this is going to be a construction update on Pantheon. So all these pictures are officially from the Instagram account of Busch Gardens Williamsburg. So a big shout out to the park uh, for these photos. Full credit goes to them. Uh, for these three photos that we're about to share with you from the construction site of Pantheon uh, This godly like machine that's going to take guests for a spin next year when it opens Obviously we won't be down there for the opening day unfortunately But it's definitely a bucket list coaster for the future As is the park, because the park is a real bucket list park for me So let's go into these construction pictures then So we're going to start off with construction picture number one On your screen right now Fandabidosi Now you can see on there one of the inversions being topped off on the construction site. You can see a crane really fitting the track and you can see the, this inversion uh, being topped off right there. So I'm really excited about that. Uh, definitely looks like a really strong inversion, especially if you're at the back, you're gonna get whipped over into that inversion. Uh, it's like an inversion like turn. It's very weird. Uh, I always think it was a, like a big overbike turn, but after the scene it was like, yeah, it's an inversion, but it feels like a, a real inverting turn in a way, I guess you could call it. Construction image number two on your screen now, Fanda Bidosi. Now this actually is opposite the turn that we just showed you a picture of, or the inversion that we showed you a picture of. Uh, so you can see lots of support, you can see a massive crane uh, in between the two, uh, between the inversion and the, the sort of collection of supports. They're awaiting for track. Uh, so that's a very cool sight to see. Uh, I think, if I've got my memory correct, that is the support uh, for the vertical spike. Again, I'm not too. Uh, I haven't remembered much about the plans and the construction and the sort of whole sort of layout. Uh, not since we did that analysis video on the on the attraction. Uh, <laughs> so uh, memory is a bit fuzzy, but I think that's vertical spike um, supports. Again, might be wrong. Uh, but either way, it looks great. It looks brilliant, doesn't it? Um, it looks like this could, could be a very good coaster. Finally, construction image number three on your screen now. Find Abby Dorsey and look at that. It's another shot of the inversion, and you can see it's a very nice shot indeed. They're going to they're fitting that top part of the inversion. You've got a massive crane up top. You've got another crane sort of linking it down at the bottom. And again, really cool. Uh, to see this ride being constructed and it's really cool to check out all these construction updates as well um, Really really excited to see this project open really can't wait to see all the opening day footage that all the American YouTubers and anyone traveling to America for the opening day are gonna get on the opening day It's gonna be brilliant. It's gonna be a really cool project um, And it's been a really cool project to follow as well because of course you guys know that we follow this project right from the beginning uh, with the confirmation of the leaks 
um, that we've got back in 2017, 2018 uh, about all this. And of course, all the SeaWorld leaks as well with the RMC Guazi, the Orlando launch coaster, things like that. We got the confirmation of the leaks of a multi-launch Soaring with Dragon type launch coaster at Busch Gardens Williamsburg for 2020 near that Festa Italia area in like an expanded part of Festa Italia but still part of the area of Festa Italia just like a Rome sort of mini plaza to go with the coaster. Um, so you know we followed this project from the beginning, we followed all the teasers, we followed all the, the rumours, the layout leaks, the layout details, the full completion, the announcement the analysis, it's just been a real steady progress of videos that we've done on this project. So make sure you go and check out our Pantheon uh, little uh, mini-series uh, playlist while it lasts. Don't forget we said uh, in a previous video, um, it was the video on, I can't remember what video it was on, but we did say that uh, the 2020 individual attraction playlist won't last. Uh, so we're going to do individual pearls for 2021. So it's like a yearly thing kind of thing. So this will last uh, until the attraction opens. Give it a month after the attraction opens. And we'll close that playlist down and build up the 2021 playlists ready for the next season. So that is it then from this construction update on Pantheon at Busch Gardens Williamsburg. Like I said again, really excited for this project. Can't wait for it to open. Thank you very much to Falco Flair for requesting this video and make sure you give a follow to Push Gardens Williamsburg on all their social media devices for more brilliant construction pictures on this new Intamin multi-launch roller coaster. Thank you very much for this construction update. Make sure you give this uh, video a like if you loved it. Make sure you comment your thoughts down below and comment down below your shout outs. Both, of, both uh, comments can give you a shout out. Just comment down below a shout out or comment down below your thoughts and I'll shout out your YouTube name in the next day of uploads. Make sure you go and check out the channel and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video um, by subscribing as well. And for now guys, I'm Coach Chow, killing the coast of life and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, have an awesome day my friends.